right, really quickly before this video starts, I just wanted to let you know that I uploaded this last week. I had it up for a few hours and then I took it down because I had to deal with some issues and I felt like it wasn't really like the right time to have this video up. So now it's back up. I'm very, very excited about this. Another thing, I filmed this before I turned 20. So at the beginning I talk about like turning 20 and blah, 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 all that stuff. There'll be a birthday vlog coming soon, by the way. But anyway, didn't want you to be confused about that. I filmed this a little while ago. That's all I have to say. Let's get into the video. Hi everybody. Welcome to my living room. I'm really excited for today's video because I haven't done one of these in a really long time and also some other reasons. I have a very, very exciting announcement in this video. So stay tuned. So I'm just gonna do my everyday makeup and talk to you. So this look, as always, is gonna be very natural, very simple, almost like a no makeup makeup look. Also, I just got my hair done. So I think I have like marks of toner on my face. Every time I pin my hair back to do my makeup, I feel so official. So I already washed my face and put on some moisturizer. Everything I'm gonna be showing is by Nude Sticks because well, I'll tell you in a second, but let me just get started with my makeup. First, I'm gonna use the Nude Sticks Blur Stick. It's just a stick and you just kind of put it all over where you need it. Yeah, that is toner. That's a little... Sorry! And then I'm gonna put this one, which is a little bit darker, also all over my face so that I can create the perfect shade. I really like this because it's like the most natural finish and it's really sheer coverage. I really hate looking like I have a bunch of foundation on, don't like cake face, you know? So this is a really, really nice product. Kinda just does what needs to be done without your face looking cakey. So now I'm just gonna use my fingers because this blends out like very, very easily. Blending it in like it's moisturizer. So first thing I would like to talk about is is the fact that I'm turning 20 in two days. Today is May 10th. I will be 20 on May 12th. What? What? First of all, what is going on? So, so crazy. I don't even know what to say. It's really, really crazy that I'm no longer gonna be a teenager. That's really weird to say. I definitely already feel older, which is really weird. Every time my birthday comes around and someone's like, do you feel older? I'm like, no. But right now, I kind of do, which is really, really weird. Leading up to my birthday, I was kind of nervous for it and I don't know, I just really didn't want to be 20, but I don't know, that's life. I guess I'm ready to be 20. <laughs> I don't know, I'm as ready as I'll ever be. Hello? Um... So I'm planning on vlogging my birthday. It's gonna be fun. I'm going to Arizona with Ellie and yeah. Why did I think closing those blinds was a good idea? The lighting sucks. The quality is so bad now. I'm sorry. It's not like this for the whole video. So sorry, just hold on. Moving on with the makeup, it's time for bronzer and blush. So let me just get it out of this nice, convenient, aesthetically pleasing kit. I kind of talked about this in my Coachella vlog, but this, Little kit right here is my it's very, very own, own Summer McKean X Nude Sticks Summer Proof Makeup Kit. You can order this little bag that comes with a bunch of my summer makeup essentials. And I really, really love all of these products so much. I use them every single day. Great quality. I've been working on this for a little bit. First of all, I want to talk about the bag a little bit. I actually designed this specifically for the summer proof kit. I thought having a clear, pretty bag would be really cute, especially for the summertime, because you can reuse this if you go to the pool or the beach, you can put your phone and your glasses and lip balm in here or whatever. But anyway, let's get into the makeup that's actually inside. I will talk about it as I use it. First of all, we have Bondi Bay, which is basically like a little bronzy stick. You can use this wherever you want, which is something that I really, really like, because you guys know I like to use bronzer on my eyelids, and I love more multi-purpose makeup products. That's what all these products are, by the way. They're also really good quality, and the finish is super natural, so I can't tell you how much I genuinely love all these products. I'm really, really, really excited about this collaboration. It makes perfect sense. Their aesthetic is my aesthetic. The type of makeup it is is just my vibe. Like, everything about it is just me, and I'm so excited. Yeah, it's really nice, too, because everything's really quick and easy to use. You can blend literally everything out with your fingers. 
usually I don't use cream bronzers because it's just like scary to me, but this is really simple to use. It's not muddy and it's a pretty sheer coverage, so it's really hard to mess it up. And if you want, it has a little brush on the other side that you can blend everything out with. Okay, so now for cheeks. I love this product. So, okay, everything I really, really love, but this is one of my top faves in the bag. So this is Cherry Blossom Babe blush stick, but again, you can use this wherever you want. So I really like this because it's kind of glossy and dewy. So it kind of adds to the natural look and it just makes your skin look so pretty. And I think it's the perfect shade for the summertime because it kind of looks like a sunburn to me. You can get all of these products on their own individually in stores and online, but I specifically chose each one of these little products down to the product and the shade for this kit only. And there's a limited amount of these kits and you can only get them online. So go to the link in my description box and get a summer proof kit. You're gonna want one. They're not gonna be on the website forever. So get them while you can. Hold on. So as you can see, it's really dewy and so pretty. I'm gonna put a little bit more on. And I also really like it because it's really easy to apply and you can reapply it throughout the day so easily. You just throw this in your bag and you're good to go. That's the blush. And you almost don't even need highlighter because it's so dewy. But of course I had to put a highlighter in this kit. So these are called Magnetic Nude Glimmers. And this is in the shade Bronzy Babe, of course. I love being bronzy. So this is kind of like a golden, Highlighter. Look how pretty that is. I'm just gonna put it everywhere and normally put it. And that is the highlighter. Also, another thing I wanna say, I think it's clear at this point that I'm not a makeup pro. I'm definitely not a beauty guru. So they're all really, really easy to use. You don't have to know what you're doing to use these products to end up still looking good, you know? Anyway, I'm using the Bondi Bay. If you don't know that I only wear bronzer on my eyelids, welcome. I'm actually gonna put a little bit of Cherry Blossom Babe on my eyelids too, just cause I like how that looks. I like the pinky brown tone. Also, this is a little bit glossy and I think that looks really cool on your eyelids. So now I'm gonna go back to this and put that in my inner corner and drag it in a little bit. I do this every day because I feel like highlighting your inner corner adds so much to the look. It's just so pretty. Now this isn't in my kit, but this is just another Nude Sticks product. On one side, you have a little pencil and I'm just gonna fill in my eyebrows a little bit. Sorry, the lighting is changing so much right now. Then on this side is the gel. So I'm gonna put the gel throughout my eyebrows. And there you have it, folks. I'm gonna curl my eyelashes and then I'm gonna do my mascara and they'll come right back. Okay, mascara is done. So now the last step is the last thing in my kit. And that is this here lip gloss, which is, oh my gosh, this is my second favorite. I have so many of these because I love it so much. The whole weekend at Coachella, I had this in my fanny pack every day and I was just reapplying this like crazy because it's like a moisturizing lip balm vibes lip gloss. You guys know, I feel like I've been saying that so much. Like you guys know, but for real, you should know by now that I love, love, lip balm. I don't know why I'm really just out here acting like everybody knows me really well. I don't know what's going on there, but I don't know why I kept saying like, you should know by now. It's really on one. I don't know. I am very picky about which lip balms I like. So this lip gloss here passes the freaking lip balm lip moisturization test. This is in the shade Nude 02. They have a bunch of different shades of lip gloss, but this is the one that I chose for my kit. I think this shade is definitely the closest color to my natural lip color, because I don't really like to go too far off of my natural lip color when it comes to lipsticks and lip glosses. I put loads of this on just because I love it. That's everything that's in my kit. So lip gloss and the highlighter come in this little container that has a mirror on the lid, so that's kind of cool. And then the cheek sticks. And that is the summer proof kit. Summer proof because you can wear it in the sun throughout your entire summer and it'll be good. That is the makeup. I had my first ever launch party. Like it was my own. Well, me and nude sticks for this little kit. And it was really, really crazy because I've never had my own official businessy party. So that was kind of crazy. I got this surfboard and everybody signed it that came. There's a limited amount of these. So go get one. Go to the link in the description box, get you one. And then if you do order a kit of your own, 
own, then please DM me, send me a screenshot of it, post it on your Instagram, tag me, let me know. Just show me because I really, really am just so excited for you guys to be able to get these. You watching this can have this and it's my own little creation. So it's really, really cool. Anyway, I'm talking a lot. Let's continue on with the get ready with me. Hair, uh, like I said, I got it done today. So I'd say it's pretty much done. It's like an ashy blonde. Now the last thing we need to do is take this sweatshirt off and put on an outfit. I'll be right back. So here's the outfit. It's this little dress from Gap, but I thrifted it. And then I'm gonna put on these white Supergas. So this is the finished look. <laughs> it's so weird because I haven't done a Get Ready With Me video in so long. This like feels weird. Let's go. I really wish I could jam out to music right now, but I'm gonna get copyrighted 100% literally I get probably like five copyright strike emails a day all of my videos are copyrighted Anyway, I want to try to find somewhere to skate right now even though I'm not really in the ideal outfit I really just want to skate. I'm at a stoplight by the way, but I don't think I said this but it just launched today Like today is the first day and that's really exciting vlogging while I'm skating. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I didn't want the video to just end after I did my makeup, so that's why I'm skating right now. But this is really funny. Also, I filmed like kind of late, so <laughs> the sun is like going down after I just finished getting ready. Whatever. I did a daytime look, but I'm wearing it in the evening. Maybe I'll go get dinner with my friend. <laughs> Me acting like I have friends. Uh oh, there's a person coming. Now I'm uncomfortable. All right, this is like the worst shoes to do it in. I know the motion, but I'm too scared to do it right now. Let's not do that right now. having a lot of fun all on my own out here. Go click the link and get yourself a summer proof kit. You won't regret it, I promise. I use this thing literally every day. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching all the way to this point of the video. Your support literally means the world to me. So shout out to the McBabe of the week. I love you. Maybe next time I'll actually go to a skate park. Until then, sayonara. This is kind of a sad video. I'm just skating alone. <laughs> Bye. Let's try that again.